High Single Pisces. This is your monthly love. Tarot cards are reading by Emma for the month of November 2022. So, we'll start with four cards and then, yep, from there, the Hangman. Ace of Swords. Ten of Wands. Nine of Pentacles. Seven of Cups, your influencing energy. Right. The hunt man paired with the Empress. Ace of Swords with Seven of Pentacles. Ten of Wands with the World. Nine of Pentacles paired with Ten of Wands. Eight of Swords, Seven of Cups. Look, um, having some sort of obligations, something which is already unpleasant, something which is feeling as imprisonment, like studying this, I don't know, uh, um, degree forever, four years. Eight of Swords, feeling stuck within some sort of situation, this uh, job, uh, these uh, obligations towards people, having some sort of obstructions around yourself and handling it, being within it forever for some reason, okay? Because you don't have way out. You do have, but you don't want to. You want to be true to your promise, to your words. You see what I'm saying? You do have reason why you stay there, why you want to stay there to the end until everything's finished and completed. But you are almost there. This energy comes up when you are very much aware that that what you are doing, that way you are, is already obstructing you. It's heavy on you. It's uncomfortable. You don't want it in your life anymore. You feel imprisoned. You want to feel free. You want to freedom for yourself you want to get rid of these obligations these obstructions or so whatever it is even if it's something honorable you are coming to the point that you don't like it anymore you don't want it for yourself anymore you want to get out of it and you do have perhaps something very promising here something is nearing to an end this kind of sort of imprisonment in this situation is coming to an end you are seeing new opportunities from this point once you free yourself Oh, your, your mind is running wild, okay? Your imagination is running wild. You're fantasizing about what after, what is going to happen now after this, okay? Once you free yourself, once you don't have these obligations or something, what are you going to do? What is going to happen? You see, out there, you are imagining, you are dreaming about your life after this. That was, I don't know, somewhere in October, perhaps, um, and there's Hangman, there's Empress, first week of November. Look, this is you being very private, first week of November. It seems to me you managed, okay, you, you freed yourself, perhaps even in October, okay, you completed with this obligation or something which was really uncomfortable. Now you are comfortable. First week of November, you are very happy with yourself. Perhaps you do have some rewards, perhaps you do have something very comfortable. At least you feel free. That brings comfort that brings up satisfaction brings greatest optimism about what from here what your life gonna look alike from now on you see what i'm saying the empress is also a lot about future but at this point you are very private you are all about this comfort feeling finally free and good and happy you see what i'm saying so you wanted to stay there you didn't want to include people to include yourself among people you didn't want anything around you okay you just needed time for yourself okay this is being very private needing time for yourself but not to suffer just to enjoy yourself okay this is enjoying yourself being alone not lonely you don't need people this time this week you need yourself that is enough now, look, Ace of Swords is a new idea, a new opportunity. This is clarity. Okay, you are ready to start a new Seven of Pentacles, whatever that you needed to do, whatever you needed to complete, to achieve, to prepare. Okay, you prepared it already. With the Seven of Pentacles, meaning your education, your new wardrobe, I don't know, something you needed to put together, which will be useful for your future life, for something else, for this opportunity, for something 
else which you want for yourself okay you are definitely going after something else completely different you did cut away something which you didn't like which was obstructive opens up this opportunity very truthful very clear way new way for you you are going for it and you are ready you've got yourself here ready with everything needed okay whatever that is as i said could be new hairstyle you want to meet people you're going to put yourself out there meaning you bought your new wardrobe your new hairstyle you see what i'm saying you're ready out there for this new life to present yourself to people to get to meet people could be just something like that okay uh, with this ace of swords um, could be that you were after new career new business okay maybe could be that at this point you don't have much of a relationship on your mind that it is important for you to complete and to finish something which is obstructive and this month you are in the process of changing getting into something new something more suitable more comfortable and from there later on you will obviously meet another be ready to attend your love life and so but this month is perhaps dealing with i don't know reminiscence of something difficult from earlier on I kind of feel this Ace of Wands is just this just understanding of the opportunity of clarity. You are free. You are new. You are different. It's going to be different from now on. In that sense, this second week of November, followed by Ten of Wands. Ten of Wands uh, in this second part of the month, very prominent. It says you are getting rid of something which was difficult getting rid of something difficult and uncomfortable and unhappy you see what i'm saying something which lasted you carried this burden for quite some time and it's over you are considering this is successful completion some rewards are following here you definitely deserve rewards and you will have it this ten of wands end of the month is with the nine of pentacles there you are with your new lovely dress or suit or with your money in your new core you see what i'm saying you with your accomplishment standing proudly there okay you've got your rewards you are proud of that what you have done what you've been through it's over it's done you responsibly stood by that what you said that what you promised that what you took upon yourself and it's completed this second part of the month is all about it this difficult time of your life filled with responsibilities okay and difficulties is over completed successfully you are having your rewards and your rewards are massive this is very luxurious energy it talks money it talks pride it talks achievements or talks big success you see what i'm saying proudly standing out there visible you see what i'm saying you are showing yourself off look at me rich look at me beautiful you see what i'm saying you've done something you prepared yourself and there you are beautiful rich successful achiever you see what i'm saying standing proud from this point on now you can attend maybe your love life looking for your soulmate or something in that sense but this is a transitioning period okay transitioning month from something which was very obstructive maybe marriage maybe relationship you see what i'm saying maybe you did have some sort of very tight very uncomfortable relationship for yourself very obstructive relationship you see what i'm saying finally you are free you are visible you can meet another you can have your love life you can have your happy life joyful life you are ready for it now at the end of the month very interesting month i, I think it's very significant month look particularly this second part of the month where you or completing and finishing successfully rounding up okay everything which you have started being proud of yourself beautiful month as i said a significant month for you though i cannot see another person i cannot see love relationship here i cannot see that you are changing your single status but i see that you will that you are changing situation for yourself making yourself available at the end of the month Anyway, Pisces, enjoy it.